Shields are dead. Well, that's what a lot of people in the community are thinking and saying, and is this exactly true? I'm not too sure, but let's check it out. What's up guys, it's Punchy, and over the last few weeks, we've received some game-changing deep bulk and balance patches that have reworked combat as we know it. Posture is one of those defensive deep bulk and resources that is so powerful for reducing damage, and shields used to make that insane. Without any noticeable downsides, before last week, a ton of players ran shields in both games ganks and 1v1 chime, but after this update, what happened to him? I've asked multiple people and played Deep Woken since the update, and I won't lie, the amount of shield users I encounter has dropped significantly. I think it's safe to say that the shield meta is gone, but what actually happened and is it that bad? Before we get started, it's important to explain the previous effect of the shields in question. So currently, every Deep Woken shield adds on posture, but before this, they acted like a multiplier, dividing the amount of posture damage you were taking and essentially giving you, you know, 1.5 times or 2 times posture, which was insane. So let's take a look. The average player has about 30 posture, and I'll use that as the standard. With 30 posture, the Tard Shield would grant us 15 posture, you know, a total of 45, but now it gives us 4 posture with a total of 34. That's the worst possible shield in the entire game, and it was essentially giving us 1.5 times extra posture, which is ridiculous. If we skip forward a bit to the con shield, this used to completely double your posture entirely by 2, but now it only gives 8 posture when it used to give around 30. Like, <laughs> that's kind of crazy, right? As you can see, shields have been nerfed very hard, but in all honesty, they should never have been this strong. Compared to their previous stats, shields have fallen very, very, very far, but they're still usable and still pretty good. Getting posture broken is probably the worst thing that can happen in PvP combat, and shields prevent that with minimal effort. To be fair, with most builds, you're specking points into Fortitude to get the Fortitude talents and HP, but shields are something bonus that you can just slap on any build. They're still good and I think they're fine, but the meta has definitely died out. Other builds can take advantage of shields turtle shell talent that reduces backstab damage and straight up negates spine cutter, so even if you aren't using shields to reduce posture, they're still a nice option if you have points to spend. In current day deep open combat, shields can be useful, but other sidearms like guns or two-handing your weapon and normally can outperform them with minimal effort. I think it's no longer the age of holding F, but in the weeks to come, everything is subject to change. Anyway, that's all for right now, and make sure to share your opinion down below and like and subscribe. We're almost at 70k, and let's hit it before the end of the year. Thanks again, it's punchin' time.